I'm Ted Stroud and I'm a Colt athlete. I don't specifically see myself as an athlete who trains just in one sport and focuses on one sport. I like to just push my body, see how far I can push myself mentally and physically, push my boundaries daily and just test, see what I can do, see what I'm physically capable of. As an athlete, like the biggest worry is always getting injured and there has been time where I've injured myself and been put myself off my routine and then coming back from rest and recovery it is quite difficult to sometimes get your like the drive back on but you've just got to block that out and that's what I did and I just got better recovered rested came back and attacked so biggest athletic achievement I've probably made is I've done full marathon 26.2 miles that's championship marathon October 2019 yeah, it was good, and I actually completed that in 3 hours 40 minutes, which is very solid time for a first marathon, so I was proud of that. I've got a few aims and a few goals for things I want to do. Uh, I've got quite a few endurance challenges, multi-day challenges, which will really push myself. And that will just be mental, mental pain, mental durability and resilient. I've got quite a few events lined up. I've got a lot of events, endurance events, multi-day endurance, tough event. They're the aims and the goals. Hey guys, I'm Lewis Fennick and I'm here to talk about Colt Sportswear. Um, the setbacks that I've endured have been just being undersized. As an undersized player, it's been tough for me to compete at the higher levels. I, I've been working in the gym and I've always tried hard to get up there and challenge the bigger players, but I don't feel like there's too many setbacks. It's just I didn't fully focus on where I was at. Before a couple of years ago, really, I took the chance in Spain to play every day and really nailed where I wanted to be. The, the setback that I suffered the most was not not knowing where I was going, not not pushing myself to the limit that I can. And now I work in the gym, I work all day trying to get better, trying to improve my physicality. Change to beach volleyball after six months in Spain. I would play down at the beach just recreationally um, before I moved to Spain. But I, I took up beach and I was doing beach near enough every day. I'd leave court and I thought my legs were going to fall off. But I, I enjoyed the the, like the ownership of every single plane. Okay, hi guys, it's Tom Ellis. I'm a Colt Sportswear athlete. With my setbacks, I had a really big setback throughout my career. Around four years ago now, I had a severe back spasm that put me out of sport for around nine months to a year. This affected me really bad as I missed out on one of my national finals for volleyball indoors. And um, it took a long time to recover and it's still not recovered fully yet. Uh, my greatest achievement would be going to Serbia. Uh, I went to Serbia in 2016 for my world championships, my first time going away of England. And um, we played really well. It was 10 days out in Serbia and it's something that you just don't get to experience much and I was so grateful to be able to be there and be a part and represent England. The reason why I've now recently transitioned to beach volleyball is because the social aspect of it is perfect. Everyone's so good to be around. It's a nice group of people and playing volleyball, you know, near enough every day with my best mate.